Good morning. It's such a better day. I feel like 100%. Sorry about the weird light thing right there. My window. Um, yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that. Anyways, I'm having some breakfast before I really get into the thick of working. Um, I have this... I don't know what it is. <laughs> it's like, what are those frozen, like quiche things that I got. I just wanted something easy and simple. So I got this quiche and I'm going to douse it in some Texas peat hot sauce. I have some mint tea with two slices of lemon and some honey in my pumpkin spice and all things nice. Even though it's not pumpkin spice in there, it is mint tea. <laughs> so having that and then I have a coffee. It was about probably this much coffee, this much coconut milk, and then some ice. <laughs> So, yeah, and then today I think I definitely want to um, get back into my groove. So I've got my, some gym clothes on, my sporty sports bra, and then some, yeah. So I'm ready to go to the gym, <laughs> get back to it. And I don't know, I've been feeling a lot better, so. Hey everybody, I have to leave the house. That's the thing. If you lose internet and you work from home, sorry, the door's wide open. <laughs> Watch out, Care. If you work from home and your internet goes out, you have to leave. <laughs> so, I am just letting the dogs out so they can go potty real quick. Um, and then, as I was about to head out, I actually got a package. I'm trying to look for scissors so we can open it up. I know I just did one of these, but <laughs> it's another awesome haul. So let me do that really quick before I leave. It's another awesome haul. It's dun da da Bath and Body Works. Oh yeah. So. This one is for candles. Last time I got, I always do their sales, like their, um, um, what was the last sale? The, whatchamacallit? Lotions, there you go. <laughs> Lotions, so this is the candle sale. Oh, I'm so excited. So, no makeup, don't care, who cares? Really? Why? So, um, yeah, I've got, oh, I love this. I'm, I got this for summer. It was on sale. Um, they're regularly like $9.50 and I think I got it for... How much did I get this for? Pineapple, three wick. Four dollars and 16 cents. Right? Pineapple. Yeah, four dollars. Great deal, right? So you put your candle inside here. So it um, kind of hides the label. Hey, no. And I also got another one for fall, which um, this one I got at full price. Which this one was $14.50 because it has a stand um, and it has pumpkins because, you know, hashtag fall decor. <laughs> so excited to use that. Um, let's see, what's the first candle? Looks like a pumpkin one. Oh, I can already. I love this one already. Pumpkin coconut. Oh my goodness. And look at how cute the cover is for that with the two squirrels. Oh, that smells delicious. Spiced pumpkin, toasted coconut, creamy vanilla, sea salted caramel. I can definitely smell the pumpkin and a little bit of the vanilla. Not too much coconut though and a little bit of the caramel. I didn't smell too much coconut in there, but it still smells really good. It kind of reminds me more of what a Starbucks pumpkin spice latte would smell like. Um, next one, another pumpkin one. You'll see a theme going along here. Pumpkin Woods. And this one, here's our expectations. Woodland spruce, cedar, clove buds, smoky vanilla. Oh, I can definitely smell the woods in that. Smells amazing. This one would be really good after Halloween, like around Thanksgiving time. 
maybe even right after Thanksgiving because it kind of smells a little bit like Christmas. So yeah, I definitely smell the woods and like a hint of the clove and the cedar. Um, Alrighty, next candle is Hello Beautiful. Mm-hmm. Oh, that just smells fresh. I want to put this one probably in our bedroom as something that just smells fresh and clean, things like that. I like that one. Love it. Um, I already knew I was going to love that scent. Speaking of Hello Beautiful, I got a little travel size body cream to put in my purse and bring with me on um, travel, actually. Don't use this yet, Lindsay. Note to self, don't use it yet. Save it for travel, because I have to go to Vegas and San Francisco. So, save this for that. No, Coda. Save this too, and bring this, that. Yes, little travel size fragrance mist. Next candle, what do you think? Is it gonna be a fall themed one? I think so. Ooh, this one's Vanilla Pumpkin Marshmallow. Definitely smells like marshmallows. Creamy Vanilla Pumpkin Spice Homemade Marshmallow Drizzled Caramel. I, I see the caramel now. Or not, I don't see the caramel. What? I smell the caramel. And there's a little speck. Get out of there, little speck. It's a little bit more sweet. This one's a hint of sweet, but not too sweet. So, it's kind of in between. Next one, could it be another pumpkin? Yes, it could. Pumpkin banana muffin, caramelized banana, pumpkin puree, walnut, and cinnamon sugar. Oh. This is a very subtle smell. I think this is one where you have to burn it to really smell and know what it is. Look, there's Gary right over there. <laughs> Scrooge, itchy, scratchy boy. Alrighty, this one probably not pumpkin, but fall themed. There's a leaf. This is the Cider Lane. Ooh, warm caramel, Granny Smith apple, dark brown sugar, ground clove. This is one of my, this is my favorite scent. Yep. I'm just hoping um, it doesn't have that sour smell when you burn it though, because some of, sometimes cidery things can smell sour, and I don't really like that scent, but this does smell subtle, and I love that. Definitely the apple, mostly caramel and sugar, and not very much clove. Next one, another pumpkin. This one is... Pumpkin apple, so red delicious apple, fall pumpkin, ground cinnamon, and clove buds. Oh, I love that. That smells good. I definitely love, like you can smell the apple and a little bit of the cinnamon in the clove. Not just a hint of pumpkin, you can't, it's not like a strong thing. So some of these, even though they all have like pumpkin scents and are named pumpkin, they actually don't all smell completely like pumpkin. So they're all a little bit different, which I love. Here's the next one. Leaves. So it must be autumn. Red gall apple, juicy fig, eucalyptus leaf. That's Dakota drinking in the background, by the way. Fur balsam. All right, that's enough. <laughs> Dakota. Yeah, drag your no. Go on. <laughs> That just smells, oh, I'm loving the scents that I picked blindly because they all smell kind of fresh, which is my favorite thing. I love scents that smell fresh rather than super strong or sweet or poor or any other way. All right, here's the final one, pumpkin spice. Let's see if it lives up to its name with toasted pumpkin seed, cinnamon stick, warm clove, and apple wood. Let's see, clear out the senses. Yep, that smells like pumpkin spice, definitely. I think this one smells like pumpkin spice, but this one smells like pumpkin spice latte. So if you want pumpkin spice latte, weirdly enough, pumpkin coconut, not pumpkin spice. Oh, those smell so good. And the last thing in here is another scent. 
and it is Moonlight Path because it's, this is another one of my favorite scents. This is like a comfort scent. I've had this as one of my favorite scents since, I don't know, high school maybe, I think. This is my new favorite scent. This is like a comfort scent. I hope they never get rid of this one because I love it so much. All right, I am, look at that mess. Leaving that for later. Heading to my mom's house to work because we both work for the same company. It's exciting. And um, she has some food <laughs> in her house and also internet. So I'm gonna go over there because my internet is down. So you guys be good. Don't demolish the house. Do good things. Love you. See you later. Peace, my friends. What a beautiful view on the way to find internet. Look at that. Whoa, look, check this out. I'm at my mom's house. Look at that beautiful deer. Just, just eating the neighbor's plants. There's a plane. Just, just chilling like it's no big deal eating the neighbor's plants. This is itchy. Well, that was pretty awesome. Huh? Got to see some deer today. That was fun. Mom, you just have like a wildlife show in your office? <laughs> huh? No. I'm sitting here working with my mom. So, and I saw them out there. That was so cool. The dogs are out there. They can't go past the little green line right there because I have invisible fence. Yeah. So they're stuck. They can't. They can't attack. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, back to work. Oh, look what my mom has in the hallway. So pretty. I'm going to the gym. My mom is also coming with me, which is exciting. So um, she's gonna try out this one gym. What's up y'all, I'm back from the gym. Here's the puppies. Hi puppies. <laughs> yeah, he's so tough. He, I am back from the gym, it was pretty fun. Um, I don't know that I want, there you go. Excuse me. <laughs> Are you in, are you done inspecting? Are you done inspecting me? Huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was at my mom's for obviously you saw a little bit, but yeah, they're smelling my mom's two dogs. What's up, homies? <laughs> How's it going? Hey guys. I'm concocting dinner. Nice. Huh? I love concoctions. <laughs> this is, I'm making a concoction. It's my way of avoiding going to the grocery store. Huh? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna finish this up and I'll show you later. Okay, showing you progress. I have a soup now. Um, it is an onion, um, half an onion, half an onion, two stalks of celery, um, two of those peppers that I got, I think they're poblanos, um, I got a bunch of kale, but I got extra, so, um, not all of that kale, it was probably one bunch, maybe a little less than a bunch and two carrots from our garden. I had Ryan get three, but um, these guys are little beasts, so didn't need too much more than that. Some organic black beans that I had just in the pantry, and um, 
what else did I put in there? Oh, this fire roasted diced Roma tomatoes with seasonings um, from Sprouts. And then I used the, the whole thing of this um, chicken stock. Some salt, some pepper, a little bit of cayenne, some cumin, garlic powder. And then these are four um, sausages from the farmer's market that I just chopped up and I am heating a pan and I'm going to fry those up and then brown them a bit and then put them in. They're already fully cooked, but um, we like them to, to be a little bit browned. So, almost done. Yo, what's crack lacking? Lindsay is done with her masterpiece. What is your masterpiece? It's just like a vegetable and sausage soup. This is amazing. Oh, what's that over there you say? Those are scissors. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I was just kidding. I was joking with the camera. Spring rolls. Spring rolls. No, those look good. Mm -hmm. Soup, spring rolls, ball, beautiful wife. Mm -hmm. These two. <laughs> it's good. All right, we're going to eat this amazing food. But of course we had to show everyone our amazing food, right? Mm-hmm. So that if you like food like this, right? Mm-hmm. Bye. Hey, dinner's done. It was amazing. Was it amazing? It was. So now we are gonna chill out. We recorded American Horror Story. I always look, when I have the screen flipped, I always look up and not at the thing. You guys, it's just, the struggle is real. That's why Casey Neistat wears sunglasses. So Does he? I need sunglasses. Did you guys catch uh, in our video at Painting with a Twist when I had the camera sitting there? I was like creepily looking at it like, is it looking at me? I don't think I did a lot of those clips. Oh, see? there was some in there, yeah. There yeah, people are probably like, what are these amateurs doing? <laughs> or they're probably like, you're awesome, but what's that guy doing? So anyways, we're going to check in or check out, whatever you want to call it. Check into watching American Horror Story. Check out of vlogging for the night and chill so <laughs> peace catch you guys remember like share comment subscribe subscribe you please. have to subscribe please we really appreciate it yeah we love subscribers so see you guys Look at the mess that they have created. I just vacuumed this the other day, you guys. Like, not meaning the other day, meaning yesterday. Yeah, I thought you vacuumed yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. Fix the lighting issue. <laughs> huh? I look like crap. No. Look how red I am. Welcome to my world. Look. Okay, this is fine.